Hello and welcome to part 4 in our series on chest x-rays. Let's have a look at this x-ray together. The first thing we notice is that this patient has a foreign body in projection to their right lung. What this is, is a port system. It is implanted in the ventral chest and has this tube going through the subclavian vein and here with its tip into the projection of the right atrium. We also see that a needle is put into this chamber, which means that it's probably in active use currently. This device is used to mostly deliver chemotherapeutics into the central venous system of the patient. Another foreign body we notice is clip material here in projection to the right breast. This means that the patient most likely had breast cancer, which was removed. These so-called seeds are implanted so that any doctor who will examine the patient later knows where the breast cancer has been and can have a close look to find any reoccurring breast cancer. Another thing we notice is that the basal parts of the lungs are very white. We also see that here on each side the white part goes a little bit higher than on the middle side. This is called a meniscus sign and is an indicator that a patient has a pleural effusion on both sides. What we also notice is that we have very fine lines going here out of the hilar regions on both sides and here horizontal lines on both sides in the basal periphery. Those lines in the basal periphery are called curly B lines and are a sign for pulmonary venous congestion. What we also see is that the patient had replacement on their teeth. We see a little bit of degenerative changes in the bone structure, so it's most likely a little bit older patient. I hope that was helpful. Thank you for watching.